Okay, let's talk about automation here. And in the last video, uh, I shared with you uh, a way that you can set up your different mailing lists using basically three mailing lists. Your main mailing list, uh, a mailing list for your different products that you give away, your freebie list, and then also uh, a mailing list of customers. Now, one thing I do want to uh, point out is that you will probably have, or I would suggest that you have, a, a freebie list for every different type of freebie that you give out, all which automatically subscribes that person to the main uh, uh, mailing list again. Now, if they're already subscribed, it won't do that. So, uh, AWeber takes care of that automatically for you. Same thing with customer lists. You probably want a, a separate list for the different customers for the different products in case you need to get in touch with them. Again, each of those are also going to be pointing back to your main mailing list. So, at the very basic level, let me show you what I've done over here. I've set up three different mailing lists. I've set up here uh, MTT, which is just my uh, initials for Marketing Tools Today, which is my blog. I made it Marketing Tools Today Main, MTT Main. I also made a list called MTT Free. That would be for um, perhaps I'm giving away an ebook or something like that to subscribe on my blog. And then last of all, MTT customers. These are people who have uh, purchased a particular product that I'm promoting at that time. Now, in order to set up this automation, we need to go to the list where we want the user to be subscribed to also. Not the one that they were already subscribed to or that they're already going to, but to the one that we want them to be added to automatically. So, in this case, I'm going to go here to the MTT main list. I'm going to select it. And then up here at the top, we have list settings, and then there are several options underneath list settings. And one of those options is here, automation. Let's go ahead and click on that. Now this is very easy to do. Again, I just want to confirm that this is the MTT main list, my main list. That was the one that was highlighted in red uh, at the very top on the video before. And now here's my automation rules. I can automatically subscribe or unsubscribe a lead based upon whether they subscribe or unsubscribe from another list. So here are the different actions that I can select from. I can have them unsubscribe from the MTT main when they subscribe to another list. They can unsubscribe from here when they unsubscribe from another list. Or last of all, I can subscribe them to their list when they subscribe to a different list. And this is the one that I'm going to use in this instance. So I'm going to select that they are going to be subscribed to this main list, my MTT main, whenever they subscribe to, let me scroll on down here and find my freebie list, my MTT free list. There it is. I'm going to tell it save. And so let's say I have on my blog, Marketing Tools Today, I'm giving away a free ebook for anybody who subscribes to my list. They subscribe in, they get their free ebook, and then lo and behold, they are also automatically subscribed to my main list. Now, the beauty of this is with AWeber is that they will not receive two confirmation messages. If you are using double opt in, they will not receive two messages. They will receive only the one opt-in into the free list. And by opting into that one, by confirming their opt-in, they will automatically be added to the other list. Now, let's go ahead and add another one here because perhaps somebody comes to my blog and they see a link for a product and they decide to purchase that product. Well, I also want them to be in that product list, but I also want them to be automatically subscribed to my main list. So, subscribe to the list MTT main when that lead subscribes to, and let me come down here and let me find my MTT customers, and I'm going to tell it save. And so now, lo and behold, whether they get a freebie off of my blog 
or whether they get a, a uh, uh, they purchase a product, automatically they're going to be subscribed to my main mailing list. And again, the beauty of this is there may be, opp uh, there may be opportunities, there may be uh, times when I need to email everybody regardless of how they, gave, how they got into my funnel. So that's very important to, uh, to do there. So now that is all taken care of. It's already been saved. Now what I'm going to do though is I'm going to switch now my lists and I'm going to switch over to my free list. And let me show you why. All right. One of my uh, options that I have in here in my MTT free list and I've already saved it is that they're going to automatically unsubscribe from my free list when they opt into my customer list. So there it gets taken, uh, it gets done automatically for me by AWeber. It's a beautiful thing. Now, of course, you probably still need to, there are going to be some people that may not uh, opt into that customer list, so you still need to do some type of a sales job there, give some type of promotion. Uh, some type of benefit for them to opting into your customer list. Many times you'll see people will offer free updates, uh, you know, for life or, or something like that. That is always very effective uh, to do there. So there's a way that you can manage a lot of your mailing lists. You can do it automatically for you, and it will save you a lot of time and a lot of headaches using the automation features of AWeber.